lot of you may not know, but I am actually a very, very good artist. In fact, let me show you all the things that I can do as a great artist, like I am. Start with just a simple line, just a simple line, just another simple line like that. And we'll kind of, we'll, we'll make the we'll make the lines a little smaller, just like that, just a little smaller, you know, just to give it a little more subtlety. And yeah, I think that's good. All right now, we'll make this this line here. We'll make it spiky, kind of like this. Nothing too fancy yet. We're just getting started. Make sure to make the spikes just a just a little bit, you know, kind of behind the other spikes, just to you know give it give it the feel that you know it's three dimensional. It's it's detailed. It's great. All right, now now what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna draw the sun up in the corner here. This is this is gonna be the sun. All right, well we're gonna make this really really thin, really thin. Just barely see it all up here. And we'll edit this all down later. You know, nothing nothing too fancy yet again. And what we're gonna do for this for this line here. These little lines we're gonna connect it to the top with these little lines that I just found out. You see. Now what we're gonna do? We're we're gonna we're gonna take this big square. We're gonna take you see this big square. We're gonna take this big square. We're gonna do. We're gonna give this little tree a friend. We're gonna you know just just in the just in the, right beside the tree. It doesn't have to be that if that fancy. Just you know swirl around. If there's a little square part there, it's it's easy. You just kind of thin that out using the the erase tool of the regular thin line. You know just. There we go. I think that looks very good. All right, now for the coloring part of this. This is really my favorite part. You know, just just color it blue like that because that's supposed to be water. That's going to be water. Don't worry. We'll we'll get more detailed. We'll get more detailed. As you can see, I'm adding the ripples of the water. And voila, we have ourselves some water. Isn't that beautiful? Such simple little things like white lines can can make all the difference. Oops, that wasn't very good. Let me just retry that. There we go. Little white lines can make all the difference. That's what she said. Now we're gonna make some white lines up here. Just really small ones, not as big as the ones down there. Start with the the big one, and then we'll work our way down. And I don't really wanna do that. It's beautiful artwork. Such beautiful artwork. You're all lucky to be watching this. You should you should thank your gods that I'm actually letting you see my masterpiece before it's even ready. There we are. Now, now, this little friend of this tree over here, we're going to make the tree a little bigger. We're going to expand the tree. Here's what we're going to do. Behind it, we're going to we're going to take something a little smaller and just make another spike, but make it really big. On this side too. There we go. Now what we're going to do is we're going to make another spike up here. In 3, 2, 1, spike. Pull that mob, pull that mob. Alright, there we go. Now, what we're going to do is we are going to make some grass over here. This is going to be, you know, we'll, we'll actually, you know, we'll, we'll make another bush. We'll make a bigger bush over here. We'll make a bigger bush. There we go. Now that we've got that big bush in place, we can start editing. Okay, now that we've edited the bush, we can start on the on the sun, the most important part of the picture, because it really, it really just, it signifies the glory of God. It signifies the power. It signifies everything that this world has. 
so beautifully. What we're gonna keep, we're gonna keep that green. You see that? And actually, what we're gonna do is we're gonna make this leaf black, just to you know, just to spice it up a little bit. You know, it doesn't have to be perfect. You know, it can be a free expression of the mind too. That's what art is so good for. It can just, you can. Well, actually, you know what? I think we should make that. Yeah. And you know what? I think since we're expressing the mind, we should make this pink. That the trunk will be pink. Actually, you know what? The sun. I think you know just because I'm I'm feeling so creative right now, I'm going to keep the sun a little little man titties. All right there. There we go. There's a little man titty sun. And then we're gonna color the grass. The yellow grass. The yellow grass that signifies the power of things in all of us, really. Now this little friend of the tree, we're gonna we're gonna push it up a bit. We're gonna push it up a bit. We're gonna take this bush, the part of the bush right there. Oops, messed that up a little bit. Oh come on! There we are. We're gonna take this part of the bush and we're gonna put the bush right there. Now for the final part of actually, you know what? I think we're gonna. We're gonna add a Canadian goose. Canadian goose. It's it's been debated whether they're called Canadian gooses or Canadian geese or Canada goose or Canadian geese or Canada geese or you know, but really. They're annoying. Doesn't matter what their name is, they're annoying as hell. So we're just gonna we're gonna make this bush have little little spines coming out of it, killing the Canadian goose. Actually, just kind of you know working them over like the dungeon master. There we go. Now, for this side over here, this is going to be the pure side. This is going to be the side. As you can see here, I'm going to be using custom colors because that's what the pros do. The pros use custom colors. We're going to make it a bit darker. Just, yeah, there we go. And we're going to, just like that. You see, this part here, this part doesn't mean anything. In fact, I'm going to put a big, just, just to even it all out, because this is what art is for. It's just to even things out. We're going to put a big, you know what, fuck you, right there. We're not even going to look at that part. This part isn't even important to the real piece of the... This isn't, this isn't important to the full scale of what I'm trying to do here. Now, for the final piece of this puzzle. We're going to add some grass over here. And we're going to make a circle up here. Add another circle up here and another circle up here and one way in the back and we're going to make them red that's not what I meant to do, I'm terribly sorry I should be killed for ruining my own art there we are, this will be, this will work, this will work there. Now the bush has a crown of endless knowledge. You know, it just adds, it just rounds up my entire art project here. So I hope you enjoyed watching me create a masterpiece of what I think should be, you know, hung in every single gallery across America, especially across America, because you know, you Americans are all cut up on Halo right away. As soon as it came out, it's Halo, Halo. Actually, you know what? Let's 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 make a Halo here, just to draw in the audience, the American audience. Let's make a Halo, because I'm certain that's what Halo means. It's not a first-person shooter or anything like that, because that just that's completely contradictory to God's glory. And I don't think an American nation would do anything like that. So. La. What a masterpiece. What a masterpiece.